We've been joined by Abraham Abdusalam from Plateau State to bring us his latest from the state. Six health workers in Plateau State have tested positive for the coronavirus disease. According to the Plateau State Commissioner for Health, Dr. Ninkam Lara, the six health workers did not have any contact with any COVID-19 patients at the isolation centers. Dr. Lara says that out of the 86 COVID-19 cases recorded in the state, 27 have been discharged while two deaths have been recorded. He says the two persons died before their test results came out. Also, a pregnant woman at the Haipang Observation Center in Burkin Lali local government area of Plateau State has been delivered a baby girl after spending 10 days at the center. The woman in her 30s had initially submitted herself willingly after suspecting she had symptoms of the coronavirus. According to the center coordinator, David Dama, the woman and baby are in good condition and will soon be discharged. She has tested negative to the coronavirus. In other in another related development, the National Assembly Caucus from Plateau State has made some donations to the state government. The caucus, led by deputy, the Deputy Speaker of the House of Representatives, Honorable Idris Maje, says the donation is to help the state fight the COVID-19 pandemic. The caucus also commended the state government for the efforts put in place in tackling the pandemic, saying it has tremendously helped residents in the state. This is the latest news from Plateau State. I'm Abraham Abrissalam reporting for Plus TV Africa's Children's Day Special News Edition. Have a good day. Our child uncle there. Thank you, Abraham Abdusalam.